I'm going to show you collaboration, which is a new feature that's been added into Komodo IDE 7. You'll find collaboration in the left pane of Komodo, underneath the collab tab, and in order to enable collaboration, you'll need an active state sign-in account. Generally, you'll already have an active state sign-in account because you'll need that for your Komodo IDE license. But if you don't have one, visit account.activestate.com and then you can uh, create the account through there. So with an active state account, you'll sign in and once you're logged in, this will automatically enable collaboration. Now the first thing you'll want to do with collaboration is to create a session. and then you can create a file to add to that session. So a session itself is actually just a grouping of files and the users who have access to edit those files. So I've actually created a new file and I have that in my session. Now the next step is that I'll actually want to share this particular file with another user. And to do that, I'll need to add a contact. I've now made the request, and to show you what this looks like, I'm going to be using VNC to connect to a Windows machine as another Komodo IDE user, and you'll be able to see what it looks like from the other user's point of view. So here I have a Komodo IDE running on Windows, as a different user and I can see that uh, demo user has requested to be added as a contact which I will confirm and uh, what that will mean is demo user can now add this particular user to the session and that means that uh, T. Whitemar will now have access to file 1 and in the other VNC session I'll open file 1 and I can see the content and I can actually uh, see that the uh, demo user made a typo here, so I'll fix that. And uh, what's really good is that if I make a selection, the cursor information is actually passed through the session to all the other users. So when I switch back to demo user, you can actually see that the, this particular piece of text is highlighted and that the margin shows green and red indicators. Uh, that's the red for deletion and the green for addition. So if I now make it another change as demo user here, add some text, and then I switch to the other user, you can see that the, the recent addi additions are highlighted in uh, bright green and then the older additions from this user has been in a darker green. So I'm no, now going to actually start collaborating with another user. I'm going to add my friend Mark and uh, request him as a contact. And now he's confirmed this and I'm going to share an existing file. Share this in session one, the logging file. And now I'm going to add Mark to my session. Mark's alias is actually a Moog, so just in case you're wondering. And then uh, I'm going to get Mark to uh, add a log fatal definition, and then I'm going to be uh, adding some other parts of the code. All right, where you go, Mark? So I'm just going to add some JS doc about the logging functions and Mark is uh, doing his work adding the log fatal. So you can see that we are both editing the file at the same time and his changes come in whilst I'm typing mine.